We have learned the person killed in a crash in Irving early this morning was a former Dallas Cowboys player. Former wide receiver Terry Glenn was killed in a single vehicle accident. CBS 11's Jennifer Lingren joins us now with more on what happened as well as reaction to the news. Jen. Now, just in the last couple of hours, Irving firefighters have confirmed that Terry Glenn was the driver of that pickup truck. He had a long NFL career, including five years in Dallas. And this morning, we're starting to see condolences come in on social media. This was the scene on Highway 114 near Walnut Hill Lane. The crash is still under investigation, but firefighters say just after midnight, Glenn was headed east and lost control and hit a barrier wall. He was ejected from the pickup truck. Paramedics rushed him to Parkland Hospital where he died. Irving police say Glenn's fiance was with him and taken to the hospital with minor injuries. Terry Glenn played right wide receiver for the Cowboys from 2003 to 2007. He was a top 10 draft pick coming out of Ohio State and also spent time with the Patriots and the Green Bay Packers. Glenn was 43 years old. A lot of players and friends of Glenn tweeting about this this morning. Former Cowboys great Tony Casillas wrote asking for prayers for Terry Glenn's family. He passed away this morning from a car accident. Prayers for his fiance. His former teammate Marcus Spears also saying heartbroken RIP. Stay with CBS 11 throughout the day for updates on this investigation.